Resident 61-8, crash course completed, valid for engineer duty. Okay, Mr. Norwood, you are scheduled for cryosleep. Bay 61, Chamber 8. Good luck to you, sir. Next resident, please, Mr. Boyd. All right, Martin. I'm sorry, it won't stink for too long. Now, let's do the eye scan. This one won't hurt, I promise. Hey, I'm sorry, but aren't you that girl, Ashley something? Ashley Sims. Yeah, I am. Sir, it's that girl who saved all those people in... Man, what was the name of that place? Redwood Rock. Yeah, that's it. The hero of Redwood Rock. Yes, I know that, Boyd. I know it very well. Then you should also know that I'm not a hero. Uh, I must disagree. I was just doing my job, General. Yes, Ashley, you did. So did everyone else who got involved in that cave rescue. But if I remember correctly, you were the only one who volunteered for what they later called a suicide mission. And precisely because of that, 15 families are alive and well today. I spoke to some of them personally. They all talk of you as if you are some kind of saint. And it's not just them. All across the globe, people recognized what you did. It moved them somehow. They started to believe again. To believe that we can count on each other. To believe that every life matters. And this belief, Ashley, this is exactly what all those people are going to need when they wake up one day. This is what will give our race the chance for a future, if there is any future at all. So, as of now, you are scheduled for cryosleep. Bay 61, Chamber 9. Good luck, and God bless. The Model 229 is a standard issue telekinetic glove by Robinson Corporation. Hello. Over here. Hello again, number nine. Who, who are you? My name is Oscar. I am a high-priority security process. What was I doing back on the floor, Oscar? You just had another blackout. You have been having them since I woke you up. Woke me up? Yes, an hour ago. Do you remember that? Ugh, my head. Feels as if it's gonna burst. I remember... survivors. Thousands of them. Sleeping inside the cryo chambers. Yes, continue. We're waiting. I I think that the surface has gone to hell or something. But we should wake up one day. Now I am sorry, I do not have any such information. What do you mean? I already explained that an hour ago. But I can't remember any of that. Then please try to focus. You are here because we had an emergency. 
the main generator has stopped for no apparent reason. Generator? Yes. It is not responding and we are losing power rapidly. At the current rate, the life support system will fail within the next 10 hours. Oh no! And when that happens, all those people inside the cryo chambers will die. Then what are you waiting for? Wake them up! I cannot. What? I tried that already, but for some reason, you remain the only person that I was able to wake up. How can this be? I, I mean... I do not know yet. But the bottom line is, you must go down there and restart that generator before it gets to be too late. Oh my... Oh... Is this for real? Come on, Ashley. Wake up. Wake up! Are you all right, number nine? I am not going to lose you again now, am I? I'm fine, Oscar. I just don't know what to think right now, okay? It is the cryo sickness. If you want to rest, I can... I said I'm fine. Now, let's get going. Those people don't have all day. Indeed. Take the corridor to your right. According to what I have gathered so far, the generator should be on the lower decks, and this is where you need to go. All right, Nine. Before you passed out, we were heading toward the nearest freight elevator. This is the blast door. Use the nearby button to open it. I am afraid that this door will require a key card. Just look around you nine. A key card must be nearby. Nine, the gap ahead of you is way too big. It is time to start using those gloves for real. <laughs> well done. You have just performed an energy jump. This way you can attract yourself to the nearby environment. Try it now. All right, now that you have learned about the energy jumps, Climb up that shaft to proceed. Now jumping down from this height will kill you. Use your gloves to ease the fall. <laughs> 